So today we'll create a real-time and customizable Telegram chatbot using ChatCPD and Python. You can also create a real-time and customizable Discord server bot by making a few changes to the Python code. I've noticed that many of you watch my videos but don't subscribe to my channel. So, please do, we're very close to reaching 10 subscribers. So, without wasting any time, let's get started. To create a Telegram bot, first, we'll go to our browser and open our Telegram website. I already have it open with my account. Then, go to the search bar and search for Bot Father. Make sure you include the ad before the start, as many fake bots have been created. After that, we'll press start and send the command, create a new bot, to create a new bot. Now, we need to name our bot whatever you want. So, I'll type it here and send it. Next, we need to select our bot's username. Whatever your username, make sure to add the bot last. If your username is available on Telegram, you'll be given a token, also known as an API. If not, you'll need to select another username. Using this token, we'll create our Telegram bot. So, let's go to chat.gpt to create our Telegram bot. I haven't told you what kind of bot I'm creating. I'm creating an image background remover bot, where we can send any of our images. The bot will remove the background and return it to us. I've already created a print for this. Simply copy it from here and paste it into chat.gpt. Now, paste your bot's token, or API, here. Copy this token from here, tap it, and then paste it here. After clicking the send button, ChatGPT will start generating Python code for us. It will also guide us on how to create our Instagram account. The API I use to remove the image background is from the RemoveBG website. So, our code has been generated. Now, we'll create a new folder where we'll store our Python file. To do this, We'll create a new folder and open it in VS Code. Next, we'll create a new Python file where we'll see the output of our code. Make sure Python is installed on your system. So, our Python file is ready. Now, first, we'll install the library, or you could call it a Python package. Scroll down and find the library provided by ChatGPT. From here, We'll copy the library and paste it into our terminal. I already have it installed, but I'll do it one more time to show you. So you can see that our requirements are already installed. You can upgrade if you want. If it's from an older version, leave it as is. Next, we'll copy our main code, our bot code, and paste it into our Python file. Now, we need to apply the API from our bot website, thebot.org, to remove the background of our images. First, we'll go to the remove.org website, where we'll find the API to remove the background of images. You can create any other type of bot if you want. But I thought this one was appropriate, so I've created one for you. Then, Click on Get API Key. You can use this API in other projects as well. After that, you'll need to create an account. I've already created a second account. The dashboard will look something like this. Click on API. If you already have an API, delete it. If you're creating a bot like me using this website, you'll need to have only one. Otherwise, the other APIs won't work. After naming the API, we'll be able to see the API. Copy it from here. Now, go back to VS Code and apply it here. Our bot is now ready to see the output. Simply copy the name we gave our Telegram bot from here. After copying, 
Search for it on Telegram. Here's our Telegram board. We'll open it, but we don't have to start it. We'll start it only when we run our code. So, first, we'll run our Python code. So, let's enlarge the terminal a little bit because our locks will show here. So, we've run our code. I've used my mobile screen to show the output. We've opened our bot. So, we can see that our Telegram board is ready. Here you can also see that the application has started and we have started our bot. So the lock is showing here. The command which we are running on the front end is visible to us here in the back end in Python. Now we send any image from here whose background we want to remove. So you can see that the process has started here. But you will get a little delay on Telegram but it works fast in our Python code. So you can see that it is done on our mobile but you can also see it here. It will be removed here also. Meaning whatever data you send from here will be visible to you here on your project also. I sent another image and it came here first but it has not come on the mobile yet. So you can see that there is a little delay in the telegram bot. So, you can make a few adjustments, and using this real-time Python code, you can create your own admin panel. By using the command on the chat, tpld, you can create ports for both the admin panel and the Discord server. This means you can create ports for multiple social media platforms with a single code, including Telegram and your Discord server. You can create a bot with a single code. So, this was the easiest way to create your own bot using AI. While I showed you how to create this API app bot, you can also create better ones with it. For example, the random people chatbot and many other such bots are very useful and can also generate income from them. If you apply the right knowledge, you can earn money from them. Learn to use the API. If you have some knowledge of Python, you can also create good bots with it. I have also seen such bots which get unlocked only after subscribing to the channel. Through this you can educate the members on your Twitter channel and group. And you can also earn a good amount by promoting something on those channels and groups. By the way, the method can be right as well as wrong, but it depends on you. You should use it in the right way. I hope you found the video interesting. If you found it interesting then please do not forget to press the like button and please do subscribe. We are very close to 10 subscribers. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.